Well, I'm gonna deal deal with this IPBM right now. No biggie. It's only one, so no biggie at all, really. Less than a second to do this shit. 0.2 seconds, which is or 0.2 in-game seconds, which is one two seconds. Blah blah blah. I don't care. So you're gonna fire at these assholes and kill them. So that means I'm gonna do this and fire over these guys and then hit over the media, which will contain the last Star Wolf member. Okay, stop. Stop. Seriously? Stop. Can I just break these things off of you already? Jesus, what takes so long? How, how long... That's what I thought. How long does it take? Seriously? Why are you... Why? There we go. Jesus. Finally. Oh my goodness. It took so long to get that one last little thing. Jesus. Should not take that long. Oh my goodness. Okay. Time to fire at you, you piece of shit. Then we're gonna head to Medio. No, actually, let's take out the base. Or the airship. The airship's closer at the end of this. And, let's be honest, airships are going to have more trouble since they sortie fighter jets and squads and whatnot. Fighter squadrons will be more effective in taking out Corn Area. Yeah, thanks, Mew. I got it. Gotcha. You're not getting away from me. Ah, oh, jeez. Yeah, the mini let's play at like 4, what is it now? 3.45 a.m. So let's head to the battleship. If we head to the battleship, we'll take care of one of the things that causes sorties of fighter jets, and fighter jets are a big thing you have to worry about. So I'm pretty much solid now, um, even with a little bit of a panic at the beginning. Um, I think I've got this. I think I've got this down for sure. Falco's got this from the bag, man. Oh god, go up! Ah, Falco. Ah, Falco. Falco, you're supposed to be the ace pilot of Star Fox. Stop. Okay, you know what? I'm just Landmaster, damn you. I'm just gonna Landmaster, damn it. I should've just done that from, like, the start. Heal me the full HP, but I should go get it. Yeah, heal me the full HP is great. Even if I'm only like two and a half things down, that's great, Pepper. Don't worry about it. <sighs> you know, I have to question some things with this whole like. Okay, doors open. That's good. I have to question some things, though. Like, why really wasn't this released? I mean, I get the fact that it was really close to the uh, N64's release date when it was thing when this thing was proposed to be released, I suppose. But why cancel a fully produced game? That much, it's a little hard for me to understand. I mean, it was fully completed. There's glitches here and there. I've had a run. I've run into a glitch where my squad. Had, the person I actually chose to be like like in my squad, it swapped out with somebody else randomly. Like I was playing as Slippy, and then it swapped out for Fox in the middle of a mission, which made no sense. And, and no, don't even. And it's not just the partner I was talking about. I had not even chosen Fox. I had chosen Falco and Slippy, and Slippy got traded with Fox, and yet still had the same things. Like it was confusing. I don't know if I'll run into that glitch here, but. 
Okay, that's one thing down. With this IPBM fired at Corneria, I might as well head back to the mothership. Starwolf's coming at me, which is not what I want. But we're not going to move. We're going to head back and fire at this last Starwolf member, which, as you suspected, if you remember Starwolf, it is Andrew. Our boss said you were nothing special. Well, guess what? I am something special, bitch. Even though I'm just mashing buttons at this point, I still got hit. I still got hit. Andrew, you piece of shit. So yeah, this was uh, supposed to be a storyline continuation to the original Star Fox. But as you know, it got canned and Star Fox 64 was made and it's a reboot to the whole Star Fox universe. So Star Fox 1 is technically not canon and everything falls to Star Fox 2, or not Star Fox 2, Star Fox 1, 64, that's what I'm trying to say. It falls to Star Fox 64 storyline, which goes as of now, 64, adventure, um, Assault and then Command off for the DS, which I haven't played, admittedly. I don't know what it's about, but apparently Andros comes back as a ghost. Jesus, no. Like, it's a stab. I don't want that. Andrew, please. Andrew, please. Andrew, please, stab. I wouldn't let you off so easy. Mm-hmm, <laughs> well, I ain't letting you off at all. I'm gonna find you, I'm gonna murder you. Don't you do your charge shot. shot on me, son. I know what I'm doing. You will not have your way, Andrew. Jeez, another one? God. How long am I spending in this fight, damn it? Oh yeah, um, if you can do a fight with one of like, the IPBMs or something, and a Star Wolf member is along its way, um, sometimes what'll happen is when you destroy the, um, the, the target, the Star Wolf member will have caught up to you by then, and will engage in a fight with you. So it's annoying like that. Oh my goodness, that IPBM is right there. <laughs> You've got spirit. Oh, God. I'm gonna give you punks a good thrashing. And now he sends out these two things, which are space creatures. And that dragon thing is the one you saw at the beginning of the opening animation. These things are gonna chase you, and they're going to be a bitch. Gotta kill these miss you. These, uh... Missiles before they hit Corneria, though, so... Use the D-pad, not the control stick. You want it to be authentic. Come here, don't you dare fall on Corneria now. Your airspace is clear, Pepper. For now, at least. Thank you, Falco. Narrating shit that shouldn't be there. <laughs> okay. Head for Corneria and ready the planet can. Okay. So you're gonna reach that first, but oh god, the virus is on its way. The hunter is there, and that hunter is there. So I'll intercept you, I guess. All right, so this guy's weak spot is, as you might have suspected, the Mirage Dragon. It'll be its mouth. As it's the only glowing thing, as it, as it were. Yes, son of a bitch. Take that. Jesus, dim frame rates. I always questioned why the frame rate would drop so much. You know, it just doesn't seem like a frame rate should drop this much. But for the SNES capabilities, I suppose it's understandable. Yeah, shoot you in the mouth, bitch. <laughs> you were no trouble at all. Mirage Dragon down, Pepper. I'm heading out to the other targets. I am Falco now, apparently. So that virus is going to hit. OK. 
kill these, fight the next hunter, and then kill the virus on the plan. Yeah, that's my plan. Kill these, or this, find... Kill the next hunter, kill the virus, which will have inevitably, by then, hit its way onto the satellite. And then, hit the squadron that got sortied, because by then, I think the cannon will be able to... Because it's already passed where it's going to fire on corn area. Oh yeah, I intercepted it before it even got to the satellite. Nice. I'm gonna have to rush though, because these things run away. Nicely done, Pepper. Your satellite is clear. I'll take down the hunter. Ooh. And then I'll go for the IBBM. This will take a little bit though, and then I'll have to go for the mothership, which is the last one remaining. But yeah, if you remember the Fantron from the last game, the Fantron makes a return in its own regard. It's still a bitch, though, so... Stop. Stop. I really don't know how the AIs in this game work like that, but Jesus. Don't do that. That's mean. Ah, God, I gotta lower below this shit. Yeah, the hype, the H Fantron is definitely a bitch. Oh, and it healed itself? No, fuck that shit. No, fuck your shit. You're not healing yourself, damn it. Constant fire, don't let it dip down. You are not killing me today, son. Oh my goodness. Jesus, that was getting close and down to the wire. Oh, oh damn. Dude, look how close that thing is. I don't think I'm going to be able to reach it in time. Damn, no, I didn't. Fuck it, head to the battleship. There's no point hitting anything else. It's going to fire soon, so shit. I'm going to have to take out the rest of those bases after this, but not after I heal up Falco. I won't allow you to go any further. I will destroy you. So this will be Andros's last battleship. After this, it can no longer sortie any squadrons. Yeah, good thing I noticed that straight off the bat. I can't barrel roll, though, so I have to take any damage that comes my way. Jesus, no, stop. Goodness, I'm gonna have to go heal after this. There's probably gonna be another interplanetary ballistic missile fire. That's what I think it's called for. Interplanetary ballistic missiles, I believe what it stands for. Don't quote me on that, as I have no clue. Being totally honest. Shit. Okay, there's a pepper plug thing there, just in case I need it. I'll go get it now. Wait, never mind. There really is no need for me, though. I mean, if I can just head back to the battleship, why waste the time? Besides, the more time I spend in here, the more time it's spent out there, and the more things get closer to being dead. So long as Corneria doesn't reach 100%, we're fine. Or, I'm fine, I say. Oh my goodness, Fluffy, what are you even controlling? You're not controlling yourself, that's for sure.
Well, now that you're destroyed, what do I do? 42%, Jesus Christ. I really should have gone for the IPBM before anything. There's no point in moving either. You'll get fired at. No, you won't. Shit, the fire is gonna reach it too. Oh my god, I think I'm gonna have to take out the other IPBM too and then take out the virus. Damn, those stupid viruses that always come around. Thanks, Andros, for being a dick. Yes, thank you. Thank you for that. I am aware. Shush. Okay. Okay, okay, what do? Two of them? Jesus. Fuck these missiles, dude. Seriously, fuck them. They're not helping anyone in any way. I really like how this game is crafted, though. Like, to be honest, it's, 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 it's interesting how this game was crafted, and... It worked. Like, it honestly did. I don't know why they didn't release it. It would have been a great release. So, I don't know. Well, there's only one missile left, but... I'll let the satellite take the hit for now while I take down this. Then take the satellite, then take out Medio. That's gonna be my plan. Okay, really? Stop being a bitch and die. So long as the, side the plant, plant defense system is there, I'll be able to not worry about missiles for at least a couple seconds. Okay. Time to remove these viruses again. Aim, Fluffy. That's what you're supposed to do. Nope, that was quick though, so we're good. He's almost been recording for an hour. This does take a while. Like, it really does take a while. Time to head the Meteor though. Or Meteor, as it is called and stuff. So we've got to activate three switches, as it is, it seems. Which, if you ask me, I'm just gonna get there via... What? What? What do, what do you want me to do? Okay. That works, I guess. Switch to Landmaster, because that's what we need to do. We need to fire this thing so that it equals the circle. Okay, that was easy. One shot. And then one more switch, which is where? This way. Dead frame rate. You dead, son. You dead. And I think this switch is a little different, if I recall correctly. It has been a little bit since I've played, but... Yeah, the switch is a little bit different. Instead of a switch flipping the forward direction, it spins to the side. Wow, jeez, lucky me. That's like... Wow, that's actually really lucky. Now that I think about it. Jeez, though, these bases are like Tartarus. Or Tartarus. I've been playing too much Persona. Tartar. Tardis. Tardis. That's what it is, not Tartarus, not Tartar. Tardis. You dummy. Alright, so I see the switch in the middle, so that implies what I'm supposed to do. Step on it. Oh my goodness. So, Retro Gaming Month. I'm liking it, to be honest. It's really nice to be able to go back and play all your old games in succession, because of the new games coming out, it's like, oh man, I really want that, because this guy said it was really good, or you know, I really want that, just because, like, fucking I've been looking forward to that game forever, and I'm not necessarily one who buys his games, like, based off of desire or hype 
from everyone else. I tend to listen to a couple people in particular about their opinions on the game. And if they have, because they generally have the same opinions as me. I mean, sometimes I disagree completely. It'd be nice to have a shield, no big deal. You can go right to hell. And then you can open. Can I get that? Is it too high? Yeah, it's too high, unless I fly, which I'm not going to bother. Destroy the enemy base's core. So yeah, on the easier difficulties, there will be less battleships, less bases for you to worry about. But in expert mode, everything comes at you, basically. So you have to learn to micromanage and stuff. But yeah, that is uh, Meteor's base down. Piece of cake.